So, <clears throat> I probably won't be able to finish everything today, but I'm hoping at minimum to do uh, one more season. So, just to kind of like give you the idea here. So yeah, these are the, the three starter characters and I've unlocked all these lads. So, progressively more power, but, you know, some sacrifices to control and, and impacts and sweet spot along the way. But let's see. I think for the time being, uh, my, my favorite is probably, probably still Jesse. Although, let me go back. Turbo spin. So yeah, um... Got the big air clubs, so... That's real helpful. That is really helpful in terms of power, though. This will this will cause me to lose a little bit of the control, but the extra few yards um, should prove useful. Okay, so we're on the pro level now, and uh, most likely at least one of the courses will be Emerald Coast. That is the fourth course in the game. But, starting off in the spring, we're back at Blue Waters, which is the, uh, the third course. Welcome, sir, welcome. You are here nice and early. Yeah, no, yeah, no pre-show. I am starting to notice here that as my control stat goes down, the uh, um, the fan that the kind of like the fan of light that goes out from uh, the ball uh, from the tee widens. So that I guess is kind of an indicator of how much your shot can deviate if you if you land on the uh, in the impact within the impact zone. That's my guess anyway. So this might veer a little bit to the left, you know, we got we got the crosswind and other stuff like that, but this is fine. It's on the beach. This is fine, gotta get my timing back. It's been almost a full week since I've played, but okay, yeah. You would think after only trickling into the bunker it wouldn't be so bad, but 55 to 100%, that's a lot of variation, so... And I can't even go above the 7, that's, that's kind of bad. So maybe I'm just going to use a power here and hope that I squeak out the max I can from this. Which, if I hit sweet spot, who knows? But alright. It's a shame I had to w use a power shot there to recover. Okay. I have to remember these putt like a, these break like a mofo. So... Going slightly uphill. Yeah, good lord, these break a lot, so... Gotta do my best to not only get green and reg, but... Do so with... Reasonable proximity. Oh lord, okay. Well, this is not a good start now, is it? Alright. Let's, uh, let's retcon. Yeah, you can kind of you can kind of say that. Although, I mean, if there's if there's a thick enough layer of frosting on it, then it actually it actually remains pretty sturdy. All right. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe I don't need the extra power. Maybe I'll just go with the standards again. Okay. Yeah, and in fact, it's it's only a it's only a three percent increase, so it's, it's it's not even that it's not even that much. So this is fine. Jesse is still a pretty strong girl. A little bit of tilt, I see. Okay, getting used to the timing now. That's double perfect twice here. Ooh, slow down, please. Okay. All right. A little bit of break at the end. Okay. Great. 
I gotta re remember not to be so hasty pressing the circle button. So, you know, because otherwise it breaks the suspense if you just zo if you just skip right to the uh, right to the end. All right, how much wind? Eh, moderate. It's not blowing too hard, so I'm confident. I'm confident with this club at least. Ah. So I so I take so I take it that the girlfriend is done with you, huh? Mm. Cool. Alrighty. Uh, you know, I mean 80-20, right? I mean, as long as you're doing stuff right 80% of the time, then, you know, you can you can screw up the other 20%. That's what I that's what I learned in uh that's what I learned in nutrition school anyway. Alright. Slightly uphill. Wow. That's pretty generous if you ask me. Alright, heck, I'll take a par. Alright, par 5. So let's see here. Wait a minute, how did I get all the way over here? Did I have a tailwind the prior time? Hmm. Well... Okay. <clears throat> Not sure if I'll get the Yuger still, but... Eh, maybe. Okay. Let's see, it's 12. Oh, that is quite elevated. So I definitely need more. I definitely need more. Now it's just a question of whether this gets high enough. Oh, that is delicious. That is a nice little rough lick. Wow. Yeah, that ball just did not want to stop. So that was almost as good as it was going to get. Because otherwise I would have just probably stuck in the bunker. All right. This will probably slope a decent bit. Ah! Give me one! Oh well. Pretty easy birdie chance now. Okay. I'll just have to see how, how tight the competition is. Leaderboard is minus two, but maybe that'll taper off as we go here. This is the uh, pro, this is the pro tier. The third out of the five tiers of the game. Okay. Okay, I need a sweet spot there. That's gonna that's gonna probably be bad, probably, because this is a, not only an elevated green, it is an uphill elevated green. So that ball was that ball was going to stop in a hurry. All right. Hopefully that's enough. Very good, man. You know, just, uh, you know, it's Friday evening. Relax. This is a pretty pretty chill game at a pretty chill pace. I'm not even sure if I'll finish uh, everything else left, because I still have three entire tier, three entire sets of tournaments and four matches at minimum, so... A lot of it will just depend on how hard the matches end up. Legend has it that the last few are definitely challenging. This ought to be fine, even though this is a huge crosswind. Huge.
I'm gonna allow the wind to push it. Okay, that's fine. I think if I average a, a birdie every two or three holes, then that should keep me on top of the leaderboard for right now. It'll get harder later, I'm sure. And supposedly flat. I would definitely watch, um, you know, some, some, uh, POV, uh, some POV golf cup television. You know, that sounds incredibly creepy, I guess, but... I should be careful with my power shots, because apparently I only have 8 for the course, rather than 12, like I thought I did. Well, I try, I try not to use it terribly often, because it is a vague enough word that, without proper context, it, it can be misconstrued. And that's why we sometimes use, uh, you know, separate words like, uh, say, erect. You are dead, ah, come on! That was a little bit firm, if you will. Yes, uh, fair enough is definitely uh, the uh, the typical uh, the typical Reddit response. I don't know for whatever reason I found myself in that part of YouTube again. You know that kookaburra actually looks pretty damn good on the water there. That was good timing. That was cool. Why are these going so far? Oh, it's probably because the wind was hardly anything. Okay. Maybe I can actually sink one. How incredible would that be? I programmed you to break. Okay. Yeah, I don't think we've had a... Uh a good solid kookaburra since episode two. And this would already be uh, episode 15. So, so. So twice a day I've been twice a day I've been releasing uh, segments of my playthroughs on my YouTube channel. And they're still going. And they will still be going. Like this, this could eventually, this could easily, this, this will easily go, uh, beyond, this will easily go beyond 20 parts here. And that's just, and that's just simply because there's quite a bit more context this time, content this time around than, uh, the first game. You are dead. More characters, more courses, more seasons. More punning fails. Yeah, I think now I'm getting to where I am becoming overly self-aware and I am either aiming too much, hitting too hard, or both. So I'm actually not at the top anymore. Oh bugger. Well, I've thought of new challenges, but I haven't I haven't added them yet. So, most likely I will broadcast again sometime uh, this weekend, and um, by that time I will have at least one new uh, community challenge added. So, you will get to use your gold. I do appreciate your loyalty. 
Yeah, this is gonna hook ever so slight, but maybe maybe that's for the better with the wind, but yeah, now we lack power. Okay. Okay. Oh, that's right, this is a power five, so. I didn't realize I was actually uh, almost Yugering that whole time. Although, maybe. That was a nice chunk of topspin, so. Maybe there was the slight chance for that to go in, but. I don't know. It's kind of it's kind of weird. Like it, in in essence, when you do topspin approaches in this, it's almost as if you're just using a longer club. Okay, we actually have a pretty solid crosswind, so I will aim proper here, just so I don't end up in the other one. Oof! Very good, very good. Okay. Nice blustery. Yeah, hitting sweet spots will help. Man, though. I keep forgetting that Jessie's spin is not terribly strong. She's only got D-rank spin, so... That ball just does not ever want to stop. It's not like there's one character that is has fantastic... Uh, Power control and spin, obviously, because then you would, then you would just be overpowered. Like in general, the way characters are balanced among you know the four stats is that they will usually either excel in in two out of the four, or they will by nature be somewhat balanced and they'll be you know just decent at at three or all four of them. So that's kind of how it works. Hopefully that's strong enough. Tisk. The opposite mistake. Okay. So it's looking like, uh... Okay, it's tapering off a little bit. So I was gonna say, it's looking like cutoff will be minus six, but... Maybe I'll do better. Yeah, let's see. What do I want to do? Yeah, I do, I do want to go here, actually. I'll have a superior angle. Rough, whatever. Scarcely a hazard to me at this point. Unless I get, like, max percentage. Okay, sweet. Pya, uh... You are, you are in, you are kind of literally in Tornado Alley, so... Um... Take cover when you need to. Alright, par 5, so... Time to bring out the big dog. And we got a Tailwind, so maybe there's a Yuga chance? Please don't drift too, mar too far right. Okay, I figured I would skip that much, but... Oh, I see. We got these trees here. But I'm wondering... I'm wondering if I will be able to... Add a fade to this ball. That would be pretty cool. Okay, so I've, I've figured, I figured out with this game that the, fa that the draws and fades work much differently. And that... You do, and that what actually happens is that, um, is that the, the, the trajectory will instantaneously veer off to the one direction and then curve back the other, and then slightly curve back. So, you know, it, it, so at that point, it's, it's kind of up to you to almost like aim straight back to where you want to go, but then, you know, you know, let the, uh, let the stroke take over, but... I'm just thinking here. Yeah, I'm in a kind of a shit lie, so... I really don't know. I'm just gonna... I'm gonna big ground this. And hope that it's... Oh yeah, that's way... That's like... That's like max... Max percentage range. That is... Hideous. That is... Unfortunate. 
Wait, but this is a par 5, so I still have the chance. And hopefully these cancel. And this is a down and then up putt. So as long as this is firm enough... Bloody hell, that... Yeah, that putt just, like, raced. That is... Mildly crazy. And disappointing. R slash mildly upsetting. I think that's one of them. Oh, this green. We meet again. Only a slight bit of tailwind. Still good. Okay. Still pretty good. That's a lot of stuff. 16 up is quite a bit. So hopefully this will be enough. <sighs> Why is putting so difficult? Hmm. Maybe you just gotta get used to it all over again. <laughs> Criminy. Okay. That score here was minus 11. Good God. Yeah, probably won't get minus 11 again here. But okay. Pretty, pretty decent wind. I mean, as long as this carries, I mean, it's a gosh darn pitching wedge. It ought to carry. Okay. It's a little further than I would like. Five inches up. Okay. No problem, dude. We'll blast the sucker right in. Or we won't because the slope at the beginning just literally didn't exist. Okay. Must keep learning. Yeah, even at this uh, this third tier of of difficulty. Yeah, opposition is not giving me much trouble still. Three powers left. So I think there ought to be at least one par three left where I wouldn't use one at all, so... This ought to be okay. Although it would... Although maybe I should save it just so that I have a chance at... Just, a, just so that top... Just so that for the final par five I have enough for two power shots. Okay. This should go over the tree. No, it shouldn't. The bloody eight iron. You'd think it would go over the tree. Oh well, that's a shame. That's a shame. Natural draw from the lie. And... Okay. A little bit of stuff, a little bit of stuff. And we'll just redeem ourselves right here. Is it just me, or is the cup shrinking? Get off the course. <laughs> nah. Well, that doesn't look great. Okay. Okay. Have it your way, I say. Alright, a little bit of a tailwind. But... Yeah, hitting sweet spots would help. Because I'm finding that my ball is veering. Negatively. But seriously, being able to get inside 10 feet so that this isn't such a problem, that would be nice. There we go. Okay. Alright. Yeah, because Silverman, Silverman got himself a birdie as well, so... Yeah, I just gotta be careful. Okay. What do I want to do? I don't want to roll into the bunker, that's the only thing. But then what lays ahead? Hmm. Yeah, I don't know, man. It's tricky. Because the ball still rolls a decent amount, even if you don't do topspin. Yeah, that's rough anyway. It's okay. Forward is max. I can still birdie.
Yeah, that's approachable. Okay. Sweet. All right. Yes! Nice straight ball coming through. That is how it's done. Delicious. How delightful. Yeah, that should secure me the tourney now. All right. Yeah, that's fair way. Okay. I'm just going to play this out here. The wind should fix the uh, the slow. Oh, okay. The wind actually did a thing. All right. Fair deal. Yeah, I'm not I'm not really in any trouble, so Okay. And we'll just finish it off evenly. Yes. Metal does a thing. Ah, can you go five minutes without saying what? <laughs> okay. So what will be my prize? Turbo spin, okay. Oh, that's right, the codes. Forgot about that. Yep, we're saving. Okay, very good. 